Well, today is day four of the trial of the former Clear Creek County deputy who shot and killed Christian Glass. Andrew Buen is charged with second degree murder. So back in 2022, Glass called 911 for help after his car got stuck. An independent investigation found that law enforcement escalated the situation upon arrival. Well, that ended with Andrew Buen shooting Glass five times and killing him. The defense argues use of force was necessary because Glass had a knife and was on drugs. Number seven reporter and attorney Jessica Crawford in the studio with this one tonight. And Jessica, Christian's mother took the stand today. Uh, very emotional testimony there. Yeah, absolutely. And when she took the stand, she spoke about who Christian was as a person. She described him as an artist who had suffered from depression in the past. So late one night in June of 2022, Christian Glass, who is on this photo here, called for help after his SUV got stranded on rocks in Silver Plume. When first responders arrived, he told them he didn't want to get out of the car. He told dispatchers he was lost. He was scared. He was hearing voices. Well, Glass also said he had some geology gear in his car that included a knife. His parents say that he was having a mental health crisis at the time. Body cam video does eventually show Buen shooting Glass multiple times, but during her testimony today, Glass's mother told jurors that many of the items in her son's car that the defense argued were weapons, like a hammer and a curved knife, were actually tools that he used for art projects. Christian had a hard time when we moved to America because um, he sort of lost he lost his identity. He found it very hard to fit in, and also his accent. So he wasn't bullied, but I would say teased a lot for his accent. Um, so he had a very hard time. He did have a very hard time. The trial continues tomorrow. In the studio, I'm Jessica Crawford, number seven.